Hi there, I'm Jack with Sioux Falls Dent Repair. Today I'm going to be fixing a dent in the hood of this 2016 Chevy Suburban. The customer here actually purchased this vehicle with the dent in the hood and they came to us to perform paintless dent repair. This will give you a pretty big understanding as far as how the dent is size wise. So this is a magnetic half dollar sized coin that we had made up just for sizing references. As you can see, the damage is quite bigger than this half dollar coin. So in order to start the repair off here, we actually end up going ahead and lifting the hood up and opening the hood. That allows us to access the hood insulator pad. From there, we remove six different under hood clips that hold the insulator pad to the bottom of the hood. That allows the insulator pad to be removed safely. From there, we actually assess the back side of the damaged area, as well as how we're gonna get a tool to physically push this damage out. For this repair, this damage was actually located underneath a braced area. So with the dent being underneath a braced area, what that means is it actually changes the type of tooling we're actually able to use here. So we were actually able to get a brace style tool between here, but if we cannot, then we have to resort to the glue pulling method where we glue a tab to the top of the vehicle's dented area and pull the damage out. So that's a lot more repetitive of a process, takes a little bit longer, but that's how we uh, typically would start out glue pulling type repairs. So I have access to the backside here, but just because of the size of the dent, I actually decided to use glue pulling to pull a lot of the bulk of the dent out, as you see here. What this allows us to do is minimize the damage and bring it up a little bit more uniform and pull a bigger area. Because with a brace tool, I can only pinpoint and push on so much area at one time, whereas a glue tab, I can adjust it you know, quite a bit bigger in order to pull more of the bulk area up. So basically, it's just kind of like a hybrid repair. So I'm using some glue pulling, but then I'm finishing off and doing the final finishing touches with a tool. Um, it ends up actually making sometimes the fastest process because I'm able to move a lot of metal at the beginning real fast and quick. And then in order to do kind of the micro precision or like we like to call sniper kind of shots essentially, um, we can get those fine tuning, getting the last little bit of orange peel all level and even with a very sharp tool. So it's a very slow, repetitive process working damage out, even something like this. We don't use any type of dry ice. The dent doesn't simply just pop out by any means whatsoever. Um, it's just a repetitive process that we have to use hundreds of pushes to work damage like this out. Then to finish up with the repair process, we do some minor polishing and buffing on the area to remove any types of scuffs and the damage is completely gone. All right, so we went on and finished up the repair on the Suburban hood. As you can see, the damage came out great. It looks fantastic. There's no indication that there was ever a dent ever in this hood. So the customer is gonna be real happy when they see this one. So if you have any kind of dents or dings in your vehicle and you'd like them repaired with the paintless dent repair method or think your vehicle might be a candidate for paintless dent repair, feel free to go ahead and give us a call at 605-250-1023. Thanks for watching.